Hi guys, I'm back, and please forgive my lighting. For some reason today, I just can't seem to get it right. So it goes in, it goes out, and then it goes in. And I'm trying to fix that. But we're going to go ahead and try and get this done without it being too dark. Okay, as I said, I went to the 99 cent store yesterday. I'm still on vacation. I have one more week. Here in California with my brother and his wife and their kids it's been relaxing I'm just kind of tired today but I needed to get this done because I hate when things pile up so here we go this is with the 99 cent store here in Hawthorne California where I've been visiting and I just had a blast yesterday I had to finally say I need to get up out of this store but what I did was I went shopping found some really great items this is part two of my finds. Okay, I'm going to start with these scarves that I found. And this is called Studio 74. These are two scarves that I found at a price of $1.99. I got one in gray. And I got one in gold. And these are the infinite scarves and if you look there it shows you how you can wear them you start here and it goes on around and it comes around and there so I thought that that was a bargain for a dollar ninety nine for these scarves and then I love makeup brushes as I always say don't wear makeup a whole lot but when I see the value of brushes I grab them this is called Princess Princessy. This kit contains all the essential tools you need to take care of your face. This set includes a powder brush, a line brush, a lip brush, sponge tip applicator, lash and bra comb. And that is this. And this was 99 cents, guys. Okay. Moving right along here, I saw this, and I've gotten some items from the Dollar Tree for fall. Forgive all the noise because I'm sitting with my window open, and it's really busy uh, Main Street, so that's why you're hearing all the cars and things. But I found this. It's a table runner, and I love the fall color. It has leaves on it, and I just thought that this was so nice that this is the lining under it, and this is the design of it on the front. And this is by, it does not say, but it's a table runner. It is 13 inches by 36 inches, and it was a dollar ninety-nine. So I can place the items that I found at the Dollar Tree on this, which will be great. Then I saw these little slippers. They call them Lady Cozy slippers, but I'm going to tell you something. They're so small, my grandbabies' uh, little feet can fit in them. And they're by uh, MJ, Lady Cozy slippers. So I got her this color. It's a pink and red, and they do have that... Um, rubber on the back of them those little dots if you can see those I got them in pink and red in this one and then purple and gray and yellow in this one and that's what they look like they got the little button and I thought they were really cute and then they have the little non-slip uh, on the back of them and this is by MJ also and these were again they were 99 cents. A lot of good Christmas stocking stuffers. And I got this for my doors. It's These are welcome mats. I got, do I have that upside down? Nope, it's upside down. It says welcome. And this is in gold, written in gold. And then the back of there. And I got two of those. And they were $1.99. So that is for my doors as people come in. 
and then I'm thinking about redoing the color of my shower curtains in the bathroom and so I saw two colors that I kind of liked and so I got them um, this one is almost in a like a zebra pattern and this is by Truly Home uh, Shower Curtain and it was a dollar ninety nine so I got that one and then the same company Truly Home this is in kind of a lime grayish color yep and these were dollar ninety nine then I got some fun things for Juliana I think she'll like these. This is a lip balm set. And it is by... Who is this company by? It does not say. But anyway, you have grape, watermelon, and strawberry. And this was 99 cents. So I think she likes that. She likes flavors in her lip balm. And then this one is Rainbow Nerds. And it is by Taste Beauty. It was a dollar ninety-nine, and it is fingernail polish in the colors, and they're scented. So it is in strawberry, um, lemon, grape. What is that? Uh, watermelon, and then they have the little thing that she can use to put in between her toes to polish her toenails so this was a dollar ninety nine if you can see that yep and it's called rainbow nerds okay and then these items I got I really have a thing for the face wipes to re remove your makeup and whether you wear makeup or not I think these are just good to take over your face if you sweat or you know you just wear your blush or your lipstick and eye pencil but this is Allure it's a makeup remover pre-moistened tilettes it has 30 in it and these were 99 cents and then I got this is no pore cleansing and moisturizer makeup remover these have 25 in them and so I got these for 99 cents. And last, I found some adult coloring books, which I thought were really great. I had been looking for the ones in the Dollar Tree, but I never could come across them. So while I was there yesterday, I noticed these and I thought, you know what? I'm going to get those. These were $1.99. And this, it does not tell me. Okay, this is published by Dream Art. Yeah, Dream Art. And I don't see the actual price of this book. But these are really nice. They're not little thin books. They're thick books. And this one is Imagine, Color, and Create Patterns. Free Your Creativity. And they were a dollar... 99 so I grabbed this one and is this the same company yep same company this book is book of doodling and coloring free your mind and enjoy coloring doodling that's the book right there and again these were from the 99 cent store and then they do have show you the other books that they have. Okay, and this is again from the same company. Relax Mandela coloring book. And on the back it shows you the other books that they have. And dollar ninety-nine. And this is what they show you in there. Okay, and this is the last one. This one is Crayola. 
Yep, this is a Crayola book. And this is by Hallmark. So, this one also was $1.99. And on the back of here, it shows you the other books that they have connected to this collection. Whim Whimsical Escape. And I thought that these were nice. So, yep. So, that is my haul for this weekend. Today is Sunday. It's been a blessed day. Went to service this morning. It was awesome. Um, the pastor taught a good word. He taught that, you know, everybody can't go on your uh, journey. And sometimes we want to carry along people that don't even are supposed to, to go with us. But for some reason, we feel we need to drag them. And then when we get them there, they're nothing but trouble. So we have to learn that in this life sometimes, everything is not meant for you to share. Because sometimes that can just bring chaos. But I am just so grateful for God's word. I'm grateful for the people of God who are bringing forth the true word. And letting us know that, you know, all things are possible if we trust and believe God. So as I enjoy the last week of my vacation, I am so grateful. I'm grateful for um, my flight here, and it was a safe flight. I'm believing for a safe flight back home to Omaha, Nebraska. And I tell you what, California is a busy city. It's a busy, busy city. But I've seen some beautiful things, and I've seen some ugly things. But I'm so grateful that I know that God is still in control. So if you don't know him, get to know him. Have a personal relationship with him. So until we have another video viewing, and if you like my videos, please give me a thumbs up or give me a thumbs down and subscribe to my channel. Just hit that button down there. And when you subscribe, you'll get all notifications of any new videos that I have. So you have a blessed week coming. Bye.